I was scared to death, y'all. Like, I was literally laying in bed praying for this moment to be over. Hey, YouTube. It's your RJ. If you are, who is this? Anyways. If you are new to my channel, welcome. What's up? Make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you are a return subscriber, welcome back to my channel. Make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button and let me know any other videos y'all want to see down below. Also, if you do want to follow my Instagram or my Twitter, it's at the beginning of the video. It'll also be at the end of the video. And my TikTok, I'll leave it down below. So, how are y'all? Like, oh my gosh. I'm probably going to be doing two videos in a row. So, <laughs> ew. Just because. I feel like it and I don't have nothing else to do with my life so um the first thing the first as y'all can tell by the title I'm about to give y'all a s interesting juicy story time with clips included if y'all hear weirdo stuff around me I'm outside because I didn't feel comfortable doing this story time in my house hence of why I haven't given none of my family members my um my youtube unless it's like my sister or something you know somebody who like already know the stuff i be doing in my life you know because yeah like it's like well my mom has my mom has heard this story before so well no she heard the second story so i'm gonna give y'all two story times in one video because the first story time it's interesting and all because i have the videos included so it makes it funny but the second one i do have a video included for the part two as well okay let me just narrow this down for y'all really really so the story time i'm about to give y'all a story time of my first time getting high of weed not no other drugs i never did no other drugs i've only done weed okay like alcohol is a drug too but that don't count because i ain't never gotten drunk I got tipsy, but I never got drunk. So, what the heck? Oh my gosh, y'all, he don't got no teeth and he biting into his burger. <gasps> he don't got no teeth. Oh my. Y'all, he was struggling to bite into that burger because he don't got no. God bless him. Anyways, so the first time I got high, y'all, this was last year. I feel like when you with somebody who smokes, you're bound to smoke. Like, not like constantly. I mean, some people do end up doing it constantly. But me, baby, I'm I'm not about that life. I mean, smoking is cool to do every once in a while. But like every day, every other day, once a week. Mm -mm. I mean, like if you do it, cool, good for you. But me, I'll probably smoke like once a month. Like I for real, I don't smoke. Um it's cool but i ain't with it like i stick to my hookah and that's all i do and my hookah is non-tobacco no nicotine it's just me and my herbs baby period like <laughs> if y'all want a video of me sitting here smoking my hookah and telling y'all a little story time i'll do that just because yeah period don't mind how i'm looking y'all like i'm really going through it in my life right now but i'm gonna go into that in my next video that's why i said i'm gonna do two videos but let's get into the video because it's gonna be too long so it was a nice cold day i'm just playing but all right so all these airplanes bro i'm not with it y'all i don't live far from the airport and airplanes be coming in through here and they be starting to get low so that's why it's so loud but anyways um so my boyfriend he smokes right and he always like try to ask me like he never forced me into it like oh smoke 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 like he already like he even be telling me like i'd be asking him I'm like you don't want somebody who could like smoke with you and chill with you he said no he's like i don't find that attractive but you smoke how hypocrite but anyways he was you know like he would just tell me like um i don't think it's cute when girls smoke like like you know like to do it every once in a while but like every day thing like all the time it's not cute that's what he would tell me but i was like you know of course like i want to try smoke at least once like you know i want to try different things not drugs i'm talking about different things in my life like okay like if i'm like it's if it's in the moment and like you know everybody's smoking blah blah, blah. i'm not the type of person actually let me say this 
I'm not the type of person, if everybody's smoking around me, I'm not finna smoke. I'm not a follow the leader person. I go about my own way. If I don't feel like smoking and everybody's smoking around me, I'm not finna do it. That's just me. No one can force me to do anything, baby. If I don't feel like smoking, boo, I'm not finna smoke. Like, the heck? But, um, anyways. So, I was just chilling. I remember I was playing Fortnite with some people or whatever, like my friends and stuff. We was playing Fortnite. And, um... The people I was on the phone with, they had all smoked before, and I never smoked, and I was like, y'all, should I do it, you know, like, blah, 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 because I was just like, whatever, like, me and my boyfriend, like, we was already talking about it, this is when I had lived with him, so I was just playing Fortnite, I don't remember, like, how it led up to me smoking, but I remember, like, the process of, like, me getting high, like, I remember that, like, how it fell and everything, that's what I'm about to explain so he was like here he gave me the blunt whatever the heck and i smoked like I, whatever you know like of course me smoking for the first time i didn't know how to inhale this and that so i start coughing like crazy and he gave me water this what happened to me like the first few times i smoked whenever i would drink water i would cough and then like i would like cough the water up like i couldn't swallow water it was weird so anyways he was like um blah, blah blah he gave me i probably took like five hits y'all like i was i kept going like i was like i don't feel it i don't feel it i don't feel it like let me keep going till i feel it and then finally i'm still sitting there playing fortnite i'm on facetime or whatever and then um this is how i knew i started getting high y'all <laughs> I'm over here playing Fortnite like I told y'all. And if you ever played Fortnite before or you know, maybe I inserted a clip, I don't know, of like what happened. So, not what happened, but like, okay, let me say this. I'm all over the place and I saw story times. But anyways, when you're on Fortnite and you about to land, you know, like you falling down and you see like the whole like Fortnite map or whatever, you falling down into wherever you want to land at. So that's what was happening. I was falling to where I was finna land at. And as I was falling down, I'm like, y'all, these buildings looking big. Like, it felt, like, so realistic. Like, I felt like I was there. I felt like I was flying, y'all. Like, I felt like I was in the game. I was like, y'all, these is getting so big. And, like, the stuff just kept the whole TV. Like, not even the TV. It's like the TV wasn't even there. I'm telling y'all, it felt like I was there in the game. The whole buildings was just moving close to me. I was like, bro, what the heck? You feel me? I was like, what the freak, y'all? Like, it was so weird. I was like, y'all, I think I'm getting high. And I kind of started to get scared. I started to, like, paranoid myself a little bit. But I didn't let it get to, like, a bad point. Because I'm like, mm -mm -mm, I'm not going to, like, share myself or nothing. So I was just playing Fortnite and like my boyfriend, he came in the room and he started laughing. Like we was just laughing together, you know, like everything was cool. We was laughing, everybody on the phone laughing at me. You know, like we just chilling for real. Until like I sat there and y'all, I started crying. Like I just started bust out crying out of nowhere. I was start talking, I was laughing and then I was crying. Then I stopped crying out of nowhere and I just started laughing again. And they was like, what the heck? Like. Like I like I told you, everybody who's in the FaceTime call has smoked before. Like they smoke, and even my boyfriend he smoked too. And he was like, "Um, what the heck? Like we ain't never seen nobody cry like that before." I'm gonna insert the clip. This is the video clip that I have. I'm gonna insert that. Y'all gonna see me crying. And I was just crying. Like my boyfriend had got like creeped out, so he literally went and so he walked out the room and sat in the hallway. And, like, was looking at me, like, are you good? But, like, I don't know why he was scared. Like, it was weird. But then, um, he came back in the room and, like, he was hugging me and stuff. He hung up the FaceTime call. He was like, oh, you shouldn't be on the phone. Why, you know? Like, he was, like, really being overprotective. Like, he was scared because he never seen that happen before. So then, uh, time goes, like, we sit on the couch. We watching a movie or whatever. We was doing something. I think we was eating and watching a movie. That's I remember we was eating and watching a movie in the living room. No, we was eating snacks. And now I got hecka hungry. Y'all know the munchies be hit. I got mad hungry, y'all. So I was like, I want to go get food. I want to go get food. So we went to go get food. And, like, it was my car. And, like, my boyfriend got a history of, like, crashing cars and stuff. So I'm not going to cap. I really didn't trust him driving my car. So I was like, I'm going to drive to Del Taco. Mind y'all, Del Taco was, like, literally up the street, like, 
you come out our apartment complex and you drive down the street and it's literally right there at the light so not like it's like right after the light so it's literally up the street though so i'm telling y'all this because this has to come into play so i'm driving right like i'm all cool because it's like dark over there like we ain't reached like where all the street lights and stuff is at and as soon as we got to the light y'all it looked like the cars was floating like they had a green line this going this way who's going this way so the cars just zoom zoom i'm like is these cars moving fast or am i tripping he said no nah, they just moving at normal pace i said ain't no way like they just look like y'all know them <clears throat> excuse me y'all know them pictures where like the cars be like they take a snapshot and the cars look like they just do 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 i'm gonna insert a picture if i don't know what i'm talking about it looked like that to me like it literally looked like these cars was floating but moving like so fast so i had got like i was like what the heck you know i don't know where i don't know and then i just start crying again i don't know why i start crying so we passed the light or whatever and i'm crying and he's like let me drive because you shouldn't be driving if you're crying and you don't know what's going on you know just all this all right y'all i'm back so he was like you shouldn't be driving and this and that and third and i was like okay okay fine so we went to go park and he started driving and then we went into the drive through line at del taco and i was like i'm fine i'm fine i'm okay and i just started laughing and then i started crying again and i got that uh, i have that video too i'm inserted right here it's gonna be i'm at del taco getting some food driving <laughs> I'm trying not to cry <laughs> I'm trying so hard not to cry <laughs> so yeah y'all after that, he was like, what's wrong, blah, blah, blah. And I'll let him know, like, I don't know. Like, I really didn't understand the reason why I was crying. Like, I really didn't understand. I don't know what I was thinking about during the time. I don't know why I was crying. My first time getting high, y'all. And then after that, that sleep hit. I do remember I went to sleep after I ate and I was done. So the next story time that I'm about to give y'all is... So this is going to be two in one because, like, this video is not going to be long. So I just feel like I should put why do i have this phone in my hand i feel like i should just put these two videos into one video so the second time i had got high was this the second time yeah this is the second time in like a few months had passed but my cousin had asked me if to smoke with her or whatever and i was like okay bet but this is like my last time like you know like whatever so this time is more interesting y'all because i had smoked and I took an edible. This is my first time taking an edible, y'all. That's why this is more interesting. And this one is deep, y'all. This one is something else. I kid you not. This one is something else. So if you stayed this far, thank you. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button if you haven't already. And let me know y'all experiences down below. But let's get into this second part. So my cousin Ty came over, whatever. And then um, my other cousin had came over and her mom had already told me because my mom of course knew that my boyfriend smoked because they came out to look at my car or whatever before i had this car and i had my audi they came out to look at the car and it smelled like weed i guess i ain't smelling it my mom was like it smelled like watermelon and weed in here and i was like really bro like her daughter finna come stay at my house you sitting over here snitching on me now i look like we finna be smoking weed in her face which was not the case we made sure she stayed in the living room with my other cousin and they sat there and they played fortnite or whatever what they was doing and we went in the room and we smoked so and i'm grown and it's my place so boo, i'm gonna do whatever i want to okay i'm not gonna do it in front of her face or smoke in her face no but if it's my house and my rules just how all these other grown folks be doing who be coming up with their rules boo i'm gonna do the same thing period let me know if i'm wrong but anyways so i guess my boyfriend had like these um worms y'all know the trolleys it was like that but it was an edible and i don't i think it was like 
500 milligrams i don't know if that's a lot it was a lot though to me so i took a bite and i was like mm, that's pretty good now i took another bite and i was like it was nasty right so i took two bites i basically ate the whole thing i did eat the whole thing right yeah i i had ate the whole edible so i had ate the whole worm and i was smoking i smoked the backwood and i smoked paper y'all i was going crazy like i was like bro what the freak so we smoking, we all having fun, blah, blah, blah. And then I got hungry. I wasn't high yet, y'all. I didn't get high yet. And I got super hungry. So we had went to Wendy's and my boyfriend had to drive. So we went to Wendy's, y'all. I remember my order. I had got a number six, a spicy chicken sandwich, heck of nuggets. I had got two number six, y'all. I was starving. Like, I was so hungry. That food was busting y'all like we was all laughing we was cool and whatever but on our way to wendy's that's when my high hit y'all and it hit but it, it didn't hit hard yet it didn't hit me hard so i just seen like like i had seen the first time i was high like the cars was going fast and they looked like they was floating that's what had happened so i was like okay blah 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 you know i was telling them i'm like i'm not even that high like i'm not even high but i was steady laughing like i was just laughing like crazy then we had got back to the crib and me and my boyfriend had went into the room. So my cousin was sleeping outside, like, not outside. They were sleeping in the living room and stuff. Me and my boyfriend went into the room. And my high had hit, y'all. Like, I was scared to death, y'all. Like, I was literally laying in bed praying for this moment to be over. I was asking God, please, please, I'll never smoke again. I'll never take an edible again and to this day i'm never taking no edible again y'all because i know that's what it was i've smoked again but that edible i'm not messing with edibles y'all that had me in a different mindset so we was just chilling there y'all and let me try to explain what happened i'm a visual person so if y'all see me doing this and like all that like how i was acting don't mind me so we was in bed we just chilling right and whenever I would lay down, like, I had got super tired, y'all. And I tried to go to sleep, and I literally, I just couldn't go to sleep. Like, I really couldn't go to sleep. Because every time I would close my eyes, a scary image would pop into my head. Like, I literally kept seeing a face, a black face with, like, red stripes on it or, like, red dots on it. And I kept seeing that every time I closed my eyes, that's what I would see. Or, like, I love my phone is crooked. That's what I would see, y'all. So, like, I couldn't even close my eyes. And every time I closed my eyes, y'all my body felt so no like when i would lay down my body felt so heavy and then it felt like i was being like levitated out of my body it felt like an outer body experience i, I feel like that's what i had i feel like i had an outer body experience and it was like different scenes like i seen different parts of my life happening over and over again like from different stuff from when i was a kid or like in my past like i just kept seeing that like my boyfriend didn't look like him like he scared me like i told him get away from me i literally pushed him away from me y'all because he had the black face with red dots or he just looked like somebody i had never seen in my life maybe i've seen him in my life before but i don't know like i really half of this night y'all i really don't even remember and he had recorded a video i might insert it in here so if y'all see it i might insert it. it might be too embarrassing i don't know but i might put it in here y'all and then I remember I was like, can you put on the TV? Because before we would go to sleep every night, like, we would put on rain sounds on our TV. And I think that's what scared me because we was trying to go to sleep. Because my cousin's baby shower was the next day. So I was like, okay, let's go to sleep. We got to wake up early tomorrow, whatever. It helps set up. So, yeah, he had put on the rain sounds. And I feel like that's what started to creep me out. I feel like I was hearing stuff in my ear. Like, it just felt so weird. So he put on the Cleveland show, y'all. And I remember this episode. I don't know if I'm tripping if this was a real episode. I don't know if this was real or not. But I know it was real because it scared me. But I don't know. So it was an episode where um, I think they went camping or something. Or the electricity went out and it was raining really hard and it was dark. And I got scared again. And then it was just all type of bad, y'all. So that's kind of what I remember what happened. I just had to sum it up because I want the video to be too long but y'all i was scared out of my mind like i have never never ever ever witnessed anything like that before i never want to go through anything like that before because that was something else that was really something else i'll never take an edible again in my life like i even be cautious when i'm smoking like when i'm smoking like i don't be like 
smoking way too much like i don't smoke way too much like i just do a little bit but i don't like that feeling and i feel like that's what triggered me into like really like not smoking as much which i'm still not tripping about but i don't know y'all it was just something else that like never again and the next day when we went to my cousin baby shower i was still high this high lasted me two days y'all i was still freaking high like not as high but like my i was like hung over type of thing but still high if that makes sense like i felt so weak i didn't want to drive i just literally just wanted to lay down i felt like throwing up i didn't feel like doing anything it was the worst y'all it was so bad so if you haven't smoked before i don't know i say try i mean i feel like everybody should try different things in their life just to see how it is but yeah that was my experience if y'all had a similar experience or a crazier experience than me let me know um make sure y'all like comment subscribe let me know any other videos y'all want to see on my channel and i'll be back with another video